Howdy hosers. Went to a card show, thought I'd show you what I got. I uh, only went to two dealers. It was a pretty small show. Uh, the first dealer I got four cards from. Here they are, in no particular order. 2016 Museum, Andres Calaraga, numbered to 199. Just a regular base, 2016 Finest, Omar Vizquel. Future Hall of Famer. And the 2015 Strata. Um, didn't necessarily want these cards, but the price was fabulous. I couldn't pass them up. Uh, and then just picked this up for, I don't know, 50 cents. Um, this is a 2005 Donruss Polo Grounds card. Really cool card. Uh, I came across this set when I was just doing eBay searches of Mauer. Uh, turns out, though, it's not that cool. It's kind of like Tops Moments and Milestones, where you've got the same image, but it's got different numbering. So I'm sure there's the same image with, like, number to 85, number to 95, number to 25, number to 55. So there's thousands of cards that look just like that. So kind of lame, kind of like the uh, Supreme. Got two beauties here, Danny Gladden, but it's the same idea. Um, same card, except the only difference is we got a purple version versus a, a teal version. This one's number to twenty. This one's number to twenty-five. Um, you know, it's the same. It's the same freaking card. And there's other colored versions as well. There's also another pose with the same sticker auto. Uh, it's kind of garbage, in my opinion. You know, kind of passing it off as a rare card, even though there's, I guess in this case, probably hundreds as opposed to thousands, but. Definitely not rare. Um, I really like these Strata cards. It's the only reason I bought this one. Not necessarily a fan of D. Gordon, but um, you know it's cool. You can look up where this jersey was used, and it turns out this is a batting practice jersey at the 2015 All-Star Game. He wore it on uh, July 14th of last year. Pretty cool. And uh, as far as these two go, you know these are not rare by any means, but. If you don't know, and I don't know how, how well this is known in the hobby, but if you have any rare Vizquel or Galarraga cards, just check out the eBay sold listings and see what those cards sell for. Just check it out. It's ridiculous. Second seller. Um, picked up another one of these Polo Grounds. Uh, these were 50% off, so probably overpay a little bit for this holiday to 85 at dollar fifty, but whatever. It's a cool card. I don't care. I uh, picked up one football card. This is a 2011 Drew Brees, number to 25, red refractor. Don't plan on keeping it. I think I can sell it on eBay for a decent amount. Did get this. I've been looking for a Gary Carter rookie card for a while. Uh, not the best copy, but that's how I roll. Can't pass up a 65 killer. Um, this 64 May Cepeda, the register is a little bit off and it's obviously miscut, but for $1.50, why not? Uh, the find of the show was this 1969 Transigram card. I didn't know what it was when I first saw it. I had a friend do a little research for me. Um, turns out the Transigram uh, started right around the turn of the century, 1900. They were a friction transfer pattern company and then switched over to board games. Um, towards the end of their run, they made some plastic figure figurines of Major League Baseball players. And Clemente was the 56th player. Someone nicely wrote 56 on there with a ballpoint pen and didn't cut it very well, but it's a pretty cool card nonetheless. And uh, oh, also paid a dollar for this from that same seller as the other 50% off. And then also out of the dollar box, I picked up these 1969 Milton Bradley cards. Uh, another Clemente. They're pretty simple, you know, part of a board game. Um, no logos or anything, but just a nice set. Photography is nothing special, but cool nonetheless. I got a Killebrew and a um, Carew from this set. So when I saw these, I just thought, why not? And uh, before I go, I just, I need to pimp out Walmart. Maybe the first time anybody's ever said that, but 
they make a comparable um, Sunkiss soda cooler to Yeti. The Yeti cooler sells at $30. This sells for $7.50. It's the same exact thing. Um, so go to your Walmart, do yourself a favor, pick one of these up. Even if you don't like to enjoy cold beverages, they do sell on eBay for $20. Have a good week.